video demonstrates the insertion of the Aero Seldinger arterial catheter using the standard Seldinger insertion technique with ultrasound guidance. The Aero Seldinger arterial catheter from Teleflex is designed to improve patient safety by eliminating confusion of catheter identification, reducing complications associated with insertion technique, and providing optimal performance leading to effective treatment for patients. To prepare for insertion, adjust the bed to the proper height and ensure that the ultrasound machine is in the proper position and easily accessible. Perform a vessel assessment using ultrasound. Using the ultrasound probe, assess the intended insertion location for the optimal insertion site. Assessment should include the vascular anatomy, vessel depth, and nerve pathways that may inhibit a successful insertion. Avoid choosing a site that would interfere with the range of motion post-insertion. This zone shows the optimal insertion area for radial insertion to minimize mechanical complications. Prior to a radial arterial catheter insertion, perform an Allen's test to confirm adequate collateral circulation. An Allen's test is performed by compressing both the ulnar and radial arteries. Instruct the patient to clench their fist for 30 seconds. The patient's hand should appear blanched. Instruct the patient to unclench their fist and release compression from the ulnar artery while maintaining pressure on the radial artery. Observe the hand for a return of blood flow for 10 seconds. The return of blood flow demonstrates a positive Allen's test and indicates that the site is acceptable for radial artery catheter insertion. Clean patient's wrist with soap and water. Next, you will want to prepare the extremity for insertion. Position the wrist in dorsal flexion to bring the artery in closer proximity to the skin. Secure the hand if needed. Don sterile gloves. Prep the insertion site with chlorhexidine-based skin prep per hospital policy. Use a scrubbing motion to create friction. Allow the proper drying time per manufacturer's instruction for use. Now apply a small fenestrated drape over the insertion area. Now we will review the catheter prior to insertion. Remove the protective shield from the catheter. Remove wire and cap from extension tubing. Next, don sterile probe cover using sterile technique. Once covered, the probe needs to be maintained on a sterile field. Administer local anesthetic when indicated. Use the ultrasound when available to visualize infiltration of local anesthetic at the intended insertion location. Using the ultrasound, identify the artery. Puncture the artery with the introducer needle using a continuous, controlled, slow, forward motion. Once blood flow is visualized, stop. Blood flashback indicates a successful entry into the artery. Avoid transfixing both walls of the artery. Lower the placement device assembly slightly. Stabilize the position of the introducer needle and carefully advance the placement wire through the needle. The reference marks on the wire indicate that the wire has exited the distal needle tip. While holding the wire, remove the introducer needle. Note: If resistance is encountered during wire advancement, withdraw the entire unit and attempt a new puncture. Advance the catheter forward over the wire guide. Once the wire has exited the extension line, grasp wire and continue to advance catheter into position. Hold the catheter in place and remove the spring wire guide assembly. A pulsatile blood flow should be visible at the end of the catheter. This is a positive arterial placement. Clamp lumen with slide clamp. Attach a pre-flush pressure transducer tubing setup or stopcock assembly. Secure the catheter to the skin. A chlorhexidine type dressing can be used for additional bloodstream infection protection. See the CDC guidelines for more details. Cover the exit site with a semi-permeable membrane dressing. Avoid looping the pressure tubing over the patient's thumb to minimize catheter malposition and dislodgement. Connect to the patient monitor, level and zero to flee the static axis. For more information on the Aero Seldinger arterial catheter, please visit aroarterial.com or contact your Teleflex Vascular Sales Representative.